Yo, 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 what is going on, ladies and gents? It is your boy here, Imo, and welcome back to another video here on my channel today. As you can see by the video title, I'm going to be showcasing how you guys can play Apex Legends Mobile for free today between right now and the 5th of March this month. But there are a couple of catches. You won't be able to showcase any gameplay. I'll explain why. clicked on this video to actually realize that you can play apex legends mobile for free right now so if you're wondering how why what well basically ea has now you know basically made a new page which is play testing um it's been a it's been around for some time actually right now but they've actually added apex legends mobile to their list which has started now there are a couple of catches though okay ladies and gents so listen carefully there are only a couple of countries that can apply for this us canada and I think there's some overseas uh, China um, and over that part of the, of the world, basically. So if you want to know how to do this on screen right now, as you can see, I'm on the play testing website. So unfortunately, I can't run you straight through the whole process because I need to switch my VPN on. But it's very straightforward. All you need to do, guys, is click your region. So of course, like I said, it needs to be US, Canada or China. Um, of course, only on this website here is just showing US. Uh, do not do not try and click US if you're from the UK like me because it registers from your IP. So <laughs> there's no getting around it. But all you're going to do is click on to US, uh, then log into your EA account and then basically just run through the steps. It will ask you a couple of basic questions. If you want to see the full process, you can go check out Rose Smith's video. I'll leave the link in the description down below. Um, but a couple of catches though, guys. If you do get accepted for the playtesting uh, for the Apex Legends Mobile, you will not be able to showcase any gameplay, record any, live stream any, or even tell your friends about it because you will be signing an NDA. Pretty much means if you showcase and break anything that's in that NDA, you are liable to get sued, um, you know, prosecuted and you know basically you're breaking the law because <laughs> you've you've signed an nda but also on top of that guys this apex legends mobile will only be lasting for two days so overall this is amazing news for apex legends mobile mainly because if they're doing the alpha right now because the, the playtesting is an alpha it's an, a very very early stage of the game which you know war in arms is pretty much in that same scenario right now we're just behind it a tad but basically the early alpha is what the playtesting is all about it's just to basically test the servers the, the game mechanics see if anything's broke any bugs glitches um and then after that then you should be getting a soft launch um of course with war in arms we we like you know we're developing that game we're, we're doing an early alpha then we're going straight for global because we haven't got the time to do do it like apex legends mobile so this is the way you need to expect it okay early alpha which is playtesting then you got your soft launch, then you got your beta, and then you have your global. There might be a couple of betas in between beta stage and global, but all we need to know right now is Apex Legends Mobile is coming very, very, very soon to the mobile devices. Just another quick uh, update though, when it comes to the playtesting, you will need an Android device. You can only, you know, play the game on an Android device. You need to have access to headphones and a microphone to plug into the game. That is a requirement. And also, you will need to fill in a couple of surveys as well. So overall, guys, like I mentioned, this is fantastic news. Uh, you know, we, we do know that Apex Legends Mobile is coming to the Nintendo Switch. But the Switch was meant to be like before mobile. But the mobile version is getting it today. So we've actually beat the Switch users. So haha <laughs> to everybody using using the Switches. But uh, well, I'm very excited. What I want to know now, though, and the information that I will try and get on my channel for you about Apex is: Is it going to be cross-platform, or is it just going to be mobile versus mobile? Um, I want to know, you know, what servers are going to be coming into the game first, uh, especially for the beta, the, you know, the soft launch, uh, which is going to be, you know, for everybody to play. Um, in fact. Is it going to be for everybody to play? That is more information I want to find out for you guys. I want to know if it's going to be a closed or an open uh, soft launch. Uh, is it going to be a closed, open, you know, beta? I want to know this information and I will find this information out for you. Also, I've seen a couple of videos going around online about what countries, uh, you know, uh, and whatnot are going to be able to access the soft launch. So that's another topic I want to talk about real quick. 
if we take a look at, um, you know, Call of Duty Mobile, they had a couple of betas. Uh, they had an Australian one. They had a Brazilian one. Uh, and then they, I think it was, what was the third one? India beta? I think it was an Indian beta. But they had free betas for three different countries. I played them all by using a VPN. Very easy to do, by the way. I will do a video on Apex Legends Mobile when we get to that point to be able to play it on a certain region. But very straightforward. I just want to know what's coming first. I want to know what's in order so I can showcase that to you guys and let you know the important information. But all you need to know right now, guys, is, you know, the, the mobile scene in 2021 is growing so rapidly right now. We've got loads of games coming. And in fact, I'll be making some more videos on these new games. We got, you know, Warzone Mobile. We got Apex Legends Mobile. We got Valorant in the works as well. We got CSGO Mobile, which I'm trying to find out if that is by the original um, devs. Uh, from valve apparently they're working cl close together or is it going to be another ripoff we don't know uh you know you got war in arms which is our game uh link in the description down below if you want to join our discord server by the way and uh yeah basically ladies and gents like the, the mobile scene right now is growing rapidly and i'm very excited to be part of it um i know it's very dry it's very dry for me it might be dry for you guys uh you know I, i'm not really playing any games right now on mobile so let's just hope that apex legends mobile um, my predictions is going to be here now. So if the, you know, the play play testing starts today and ends on the 5th, it's probably going to give them a month um, to evaluate the information and the, the code in to see what was working well, what wasn't, if there was any bugs, especially all the surveys that the play testers will be, you know, signing. So I'll, I want to know what's what. Um, and, you know, that, that's pretty much it, really. So Guys, if you've enjoyed this video, please smash a like, subscribe. Let me know in the comment section down below if you want to see more Apex Legends news. I know that my last video, if you haven't checked it out, go check it out now on Apex Legends Mobile. That performed very well. So uh, I'm kind of interested to keep doing these videos because this is a game that I really do want to grind when it does come out. Um, and of course, War in Arms as well. So if you don't know what War in Arms is, go check it out. Link in the description down below to join our Discord server. Um, it's basically Rainbow Six Siege Mobile. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Like I said, drop a like, subscribe, and take care now. Bye-bye.